Hey everyone, thanks for watching our videos. A lot of you have requested that I do an installation um, of the CM Storm Quickfire TK fully backlit mechanical keyboard. And lucky for you, I have one right over here. And I'll be doing installation with the Max Keyboard Universal mechanical keyboard keycap set. Alrighty, now I'm going to start removing all the one unit keycaps with my plastic keycap puller. Okay, here we have the bottom row modifier keys. The controls are 1.5 unit, windows are 1 unit, FN is 1 unit, and the alt keys are 1.25 unit, and the spacebar is 6.5 unit. Okay, so the CM Storm Quickfire TK has cherry type stabilizer bars, meaning the stabilizer bars are already installed underneath. And one of my favorite ways to remove the keycap is by using two of my hands and just removing it gently by pulling it upwards. You can see the stabilizer bar is already installed underneath the metal plate right over here. Okay, I'm going to install everything. It's already pre-labeled, so pretty simple. So I'm going to install with the second level here, which has the two controls. And the windows, which you can use this one. And the alt key is on the first level, since it's smaller. So remember the space bar is 6.5 unit. You're going to find that in the second level. It's already pre-labeled, 6.5. A Quickfire TK has a shared key layout on the number pad. It can be used as an arrow key or a number key. But today we're going to use the arrow key to fit it in. Okay, here is the Quickfire TK on default mode. Here it is in gaming mode, full backlit mode, and breathing mode. And this is what the Quickfire TK looks like in a fully dark room. If you like our videos, please feel free to subscribe or thumbs up.